Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up mods for Beat Saber and download custom songs. The way modding works in Beat Saber doesn't change much, so even if you're watching this in a few months, the tutorial should still work fine. Now, the first thing you want to do to download mods is go to this link, github.com slash assistant slash mod assistant, I'll put it in the description. And you'll want to click on the releases tab or this big download here button. And then you want to scroll down and click on modassistant.exe. This will download the program that you need to install mods. When you open up Mod Assistant, you should be greeted with this screen. Just read through what it says. And then once you've read it, hit I agree and you'll be able to download mods. One thing you'll want to do before installing mods is you'll want to have opened Beat Saber at least once and have gone to the menu screen. After that, you can just close the game and install your mods. After that, you can click on the mods tab and tick which mods you want to install. So if you want to have camera 2, which I would recommend installing, then you can tick it and then in the bottom right, click install or update. There's lots of mods to choose from, so feel free to scroll through and read the description of what the mods do. Once you've picked all the mods you want, hit install or update and it will download the mods for you. Once your mods are installed, you should be able to just open the game and to check if your mods are working, you can look to the left in the menu and if there's a mods tab with some mod options, then you'll know that the mods you've installed are working. As you can see, the camera 2 that I installed is showing up under the mods tab and I can configure it here. So that's how to install mods, but you may still be wondering how to install custom songs. To do that, you'll want to go back into Mod Assistant, click on Options, click on Enable One-Click Installs, and check Beat Saver. This will make it so that you can just click one button on the song downloading website and it will download straight into your game. After doing that, you can go on Beat Saver, select any song you like, and download it with just one button. For example, if I want to download this map, I just need to click this little cloud icon, I'll get this prompt and then I'll see the song downloading and it'll give me a status on whether it's finished or not. If one click install isn't working for you and you've tried reinstalling Mod Assistant and everything, one other way is to click the direct download button underneath the cloud and then you can unzip the file and put it in your Beat Saber custom levels folder. To get to this folder, you'll want to go into your Beat Saber root directory, click on Beat Saber data click on custom levels and then you can paste it into here. In the description I'll put the file path of Beat Saber on Oculus or Steam so that you can easily get to this folder. As you can see when I go into game and go to the custom levels tab I can see the map that I downloaded here. If you're looking for a mod that isn't in Mod Assistant you can also check the Beat Saber modding group discord server. In this server there's a PC mods channel where anyone can post their mods. One thing to keep in mind is that these mods aren't checked for malware, so you may want to check the modder to see if they're trustworthy or not. If you're looking for a specific mod, you can use the search tab in Discord and type in PC mods and then search the mod name. So let's say, for example, I wanted to install the JD Fixer mod. What I would do is I would type in in PC mods jd fixer and as you can see it comes up and i can jump to the message and download it if you do download a mod like this you'll need to put the dll file into the plugins folder manually i'll show you how to do this now first you'll need to download the dll then you'll need to copy the dll and go into your beat saber root directory as i said the file path for this will be in the description then all you have to do is go into plugins and paste the DLL file there. That's all you need to know for how to get started modding Beat Saber. If you have any questions, feel free to join my Discord server in the description and ask any questions there. If this video helped you out, feel free to leave a like and subscribe as it helps support the channel. Thanks for watching and goodbye.